Just you alone. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. <clears throat> Begin. Daisy. That was good. Well, just in case you're thinking I'm writing or I'm sending this letter because I'm sorry about anything. I'm not stirred, sorry. And I'll never be sorry for anything. I don't regret what I did. I will never regret what I did. One thing I know, I will regret in this life, or I still regret in this life, is knowing you. It was easy to walk away, even when you did not do anything. You didn't do anything, but you did a lot of things. So the only good thing you did was to make me strong, to make me better, to make me more matured, and to make me a mother. But yeah, even if you're ready to do one of the things and be a father, but anyway, I'm not interested. <clears throat> There's so many things life has to offer, and I'm ready to embrace life the way it comes. I'm better, I'm stronger, Cass is good, and you still never see her. And I need you to be better. I need you to be stronger. I need you to be ready to face whatever comes because a lot of things will come from me. So be ready, be strong, brace yourself, and we'll meet on the battlefield. Come to. Because he's not, he's not worth being loved. What did you teach him? Sir? What did you teach him? That he's not worth being loved. Because somebody that is worth being loved will have an atom of love to give to a child. What did you come for years? I will not, I will not listen. Because it's not worth it. I just said it. Passages hold. Please stand up and walk up to her as in the zero position. 
and ask the question. I'm good. Do you know if you deprive your daughter from seeing her father, you are trying to make her feel the same way I felt years ago? Wow, okay. So I'm a father and I am a mother. I have a brother, I have a father. They are, they are all ready to be her father. And <laughs> see, everybody, listen to me, everybody is ready to be a father to Cassie. Okay, let me tell you this. Do you know do you know what it is for you to feel that fatherly love? Yes, I know what it is. And you want her to miss? She's not going to miss it. She won't. Do you know a, a big difference between your own and our own? Who is our? Cassie is going to be our if you want that. Our how no. She's right. mine. She's not ours. She's yours. No, you said you want your mine. brothers and your siblings to uh -huh. be your father. Uh -huh. Definitely she they are going to be our. They are going to call her our daughter. Yes, now she's our daughter. My dear. Is she who person's daughter? My dear, mm. let me tell you this simple truth. Mm. You are totally wrong. I'm not wrong. I will never be wrong. <laughs> Next. I just wanted to answer me one question. Right. Why not? In a few words, mm. um, tell me what you would do if your daughter tends to walk up to you mm. in the same situation. What advice would you give to her? I'll tell her the truth. I'll tell her what happened. It's not for her to make her choice, but I know she won't. She would make the right decision. That's just the truth. Okay, I'm sure about that. Yes, I'm sure. Okay, I haven't got to my question. Sure. What I mean is, if, God forbid, we don't prefer anything like this, mm -hmm. what if, okay, maybe the person that is in your daughter, mm -hmm. said, in this condition, and walks up to you for in advice, condition? like having the daughter and the father left, mm -hmm. walks up to you for advice, what would you I'll have? listen to her story. I'll know what happened. I'll know the circumstances that were surrounded by it. And I will not advise her to forgive. That's the truth. <laughs> Come to. Sir. Do you have a forgiving heart? No, I don't. Why? I don't know. I was just created like that. If you are to be God, then we there be human living this earth. No. Now what? So. Do you have a daughter? Yes, I do. Okay. What if, I don't prefer that, what if a situation comes and by the only thing you have to do to save your daughter is to reconcile with your dad? I won't. She will die? She will not die. But I won't accident. reconcile with him. Even if to make your daughter happy? I won't. Don't try yourself. Don't try yourself. If you know, come back to mm -hmm. being the president mm -hmm. of this country mm -hmm. with so much money, mm -hmm. with you, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but you know you told me that you need to take responsibilities and you need to come back with it. Yes, you need to take responsibilities. But when it comes with you, you will not get access to Cassie. Yes, if she wants to, so to Cassie, yes. will go back and want to go back to Cassie. Yes. If she wants to, it's her choice. Yes, if she's only able to make a decision. She needs to be up to 18. She has to be up to 18. 100 million dollars in your account. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Can I sit? Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
Ini pun sudah sangat sedikit nanti. Ibu Chan, ada question for me. Ada question for me. Captain, can I sit? Please sit down. Thank you, Captain.